What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be doing an install of a GGB mountain can on a 2022 RMK Pro 850 Matrix chassis. So quick unboxing, we've got one sheet of instructions. If you've ever installed a can before, you know it's basically as easy as it gets. So there's not much to the instructions. Um, to be honest, the pictures could be a little better. They're black and white and pretty blurry. So we'll go ahead and do a step-by-step -step as we install this. Next is the can itself. The packaging is really good. There's no play inside the box, so you know the pipe's not getting banged around and shipping. So there's the can itself. And we will do a weight comparison between uh, this mountain can and the stock can. And it also comes with a zip tie as you need to cut one of the zip ties during the installation. So pretty basic, not much in there. We'll go ahead and jump right into this install and of course we'll have some uh, sound clips of before and after. And also we'll throw in a little bonus footage of throwing on a muff pot and seeing how that installs and how it fits on this new mountain can. So let's jump right into it guys. First things first, pull off the right side panel. Okay, next we are going to loosen and remove the EGT probe. So that's an 11 16th wrench. Remove the probe and we'll just set that aside. Okay, now the EGT probe is removed. We've got a bunch of springs to remove. So we've got one, two is just below, three, and four on the side. So we'll go ahead and get those pulled. Okay, so this bottom one was a little tricky to get, just kind of had to squeeze your hand in there. But that's all it is, is just the four springs and the EGT probe at the top. And factory muffler is out. Okay, so we've got the factory muffler and the GGB mountain can on the workbench. And so just a quick glance, we can see just the size difference here. We know there's going to be a huge weight difference. I believe on the website they claim 11 pounds. So let's go ahead and verify that. Got our digital scale here. Let's turn it on. Set on pounds. Let's 
So 16.02 pounds. So 16.02 pounds for factory muffler. Reset it. So 5.11 pounds for the GGB mountain can. So we'll call it 16 pounds and we'll call it five pounds. So just like they claim on the website, that's an 11 pound weight difference. And we know in the sledding world, that is a very, very significant uh, weight loss. So that's gonna result in awesome performance as well. So now that we've got that done, let's go ahead with installing the new can and hear how it sounds. Okay, so we've got the mountain can. So first you're gonna kinda just loosely place it where it's gonna go. And then we're gonna reinstall the EGT probe. So in the instructions, it wants us to cut this zip tie to free up the probe a little more. But if you start with the can, just with the tip inside the cutout, you'll have enough room without having to cut this zip tie. So we've got that in, tighten it up. And so now all it is, if you've got two hangers you see here, so this one's gonna go on this frame brace, the bottom one is gonna go on the frame at the bottom. So once you line that up, it just slides right into place, mates up with the main pipe. And just like that, we're installed. So we'll have the two springs here, the one spring down on the side. So we'll go ahead and get those fastened. This fourth spring is not gonna be used. Okay, three springs are fastened. Our EGT probe is installed. And that's all there is to it. Okay, so like I had mentioned, some bonus footage. We're gonna go ahead and see how a muff pot installs on the mountain can. The hose clamp they provide is way too big. So I went ahead and cut off about eight inches of it. So let's just go ahead and rough fit this. I think I'm gonna have the can facing the front of the sled just in the interest of keeping it away from the belt drive. Okay, so that's not a terrible spot there. So the nice thing about the mountain can is you've got a ton of space to play around with mounting positions for this. So this seems like a decent spot, so we'll test fit with the side panel, make sure all the clearances are good. Don't wanna be burning any plastics, but this looks like it's gonna work and we are gonna have some warm meals on the mountain. So let's go ahead and fire this thing up and see how it sounds.
All right, guys, that's gonna be a wrap on the video. So really quick and easy install. You could probably do it from start to finish in under 10 minutes. And let me tell you, it sounds amazing. I didn't get too crazy on the revs there. It is about 8.30 p.m. on a Monday evening. So don't want the neighbors to completely hate me. But hopefully you got an idea of what it sounds like. Really, really sounds great. Really snappy. But if you want to hear more, make sure to hit that subscribe button because we're going to have tons of footage of this sled on the mountain, wide open, listening to that GGB mountain can scream. So thanks for watching, guys. Drop a like if you liked the video. Like I said, hit that subscribe button. We got lots of footage coming. We'll see you guys in the next video.